Welcome back. In this video, I will discuss how to find the membership function given fuzzy sets with the help of simple solved example. This is the solved example number 3. Link for other examples is given in the description below. In this case, we need to compare the two sensors based on their detection level and gain settings. In this case, uh, gain settings and the detection level of both the sensors are given to us. What we need to do is uh, we need to convert this data into a uh, fuzzy set and then we need to perform different operations such as union, intersection, complement and difference. So these are the different uh, membership functions we need to find out in this uh, example. First, we will convert this given data in the form of uh, fuzzy sets. If you notice this uh, gain settings, uh, there are uh, six uh, possibilities are there. That is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 and 0. So what we do is uh, we will consider these as the members of uh, fuzzy set and the detection level as the membership value in this case. So that can be represented something like this. D1 is a fuzzy set where 0 is the element in that uh, fuzzy set and its detection level is 0 here. So that is what I have written in the first case. Second one is uh, 10 is the element and its de detection level is uh, 0.2 here. So that is what I have written here. Similarly, I have written for the remaining elements. The same thing has been done for the second fuzzy set that is uh, fuzzy set uh, D2 here. Again, uh, 0 is the element and its uh, detection level is 0 here. Second one is uh, uh, 10 is the element and its uh, detection level is 0.35 that is what I have written here. Similarly, I have written for the remaining things here. Now, once uh, we have uh, two fuzzy sets, next what we need to do is uh, we need to find out the membership value of X in the union of uh, fuzzy set D1 and D2 here. Now, how to calculate it? It is calculated using this formula that is the uh, maximum of the membership value of X in uh, fuzzy set D1, comma membership value of X in fuzzy set D2 here. That is nothing but we need to consider the maximum uh, membership value in uh, two fuzzy sets here. Now, if you compare the element 0 here, the maximum membership value for this element uh, 0 is 0 only because in both the cases we have 0 here. So, that is what uh, the thing present in the union here. Similarly, for element 10, for element 10, the membership value in D1 is 0.2 and 0 0.35 in D2 here. Because of that, uh, the union contains the membership value as 0.35. Similarly, I have written it for the remaining elements in this case. Now, coming back to the uh, second question that is uh, membership value of x in the intersection of uh, d1 and d2 here. Now, how to calculate the intersection of uh, two fuzzy sets? That is nothing but the minimum of membership value of x in the first fuzzy set that is d1 and second fuzzy set that is d2 here. Now, uh, in the previous case, we have considered the maximum. In this case, we need to consider the minimum here. For zero element, again, both the uh, fuzzy sets have 0 as the value, so minimum is 0 again, so we will be getting 0 here. But for 10, the membership value is 0.2 in D1, 0.35 in uh, D2 here, between these two, 0.2 is minimum, that is what I have written here. For the next one, that is 20, uh, between uh, 0.35 and 0 0.25, 0 0.25 is minimum, that is what is written here. Similarly, I have written for the remaining elements in this case. Now, coming back to the third uh, uh, question, that is the uh, membership value of X in D1 complement. Now, how to calculate uh, the membership value in uh, uh, fuzzy set D1 complement? That is equivalent to 1 minus membership value in uh, fuzzy set D1 here. So, we have uh, the membership value in D1. So, what we need to do? 1 minus uh, D1 we have to do here. So, that is nothing but uh, for element 0, 0 is the membership value. So, 1 minus 0 is equivalent to 1 here. For element 10, the membership value is uh, 0.2 here. There is nothing but 1 minus 0 0.2 which is equivalent to 0.8. Similarly, I have done it for the remaining elements in this case. Coming back to the next one, that is the membership value of X in uh, D2's complement here. Again, what we need to do? 1 minus membership value of X in D2 we need to do here. Again, we have all the membership values here. We need to take the complement, that is 1 minus uh, those things. That is nothing but for 0, 1 minus uh, 0 is equal to 1 here. For 10, 1 minus 0 0.35 is equal to 0 0.65 and so on here. Coming back to the next question, that is, uh, we need to calculate the membership value of X in uh, fuzzy set D1 union fuzzy set D1's complement here. We have already calculated the complement of fuzzy set D1, that is nothing but uh, this one. We need to consider this while calculating the membership value of X in this union here. That is equivalent to maximum of membership value of X in uh, 
So as you said, D1, comma, membership value of X in uh, D1's uh, complement here. Now we need to consider the maximum value here. Uh, for 0, if we consider this 0 and this 0, for element 0, uh, the membership value is 0 in D1 and its complement is 1 here. So what is the maximum in this case? 1 is the maximum. So that is what is present in this uh, membership function here. Similarly, for element 10, the 0.2 in uh, D1, 0 0.8 in, in its complement. So 0 0.8 will be there in union and so on. So this is how we can calculate the membership function for this uh, example here. Coming back to the last question, in this case, we need to calculate the membership value of an element X in fuzzy set D1 intersection its complement here. Again, we have already calculated this uh, complement. We can use that thing over here. Uh, now, how to calculate it? Again, if you want to calculate the intersection, we need to consider the minimum. In, th in this case, we have considered maximum. In this case, we need to consider the minimum here. So, between these two, that is uh, for element 0, 0 and 1 are the me membership values. Between these two, 0 is the minimum. That is what I have written here. For uh, 10, uh, between 0 0.2 and 0 0.8, 0 0.2 is minimum. That is what is written here. Similarly, for element 20, between 0 0.35 and 0 0.65, 0 0.35 is minimum. That is what is written here. Similarly, I have written for the remaining elements in this case. So, in this video, I have discussed given a fuzzy sets, how to find the membership values for the given elements. I hope the concept of uh, operations on fuzzy sets is clear. If you like the video, do like and share with your friends. Press the subscribe button for more videos. Press the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you for watching.